him because I believe that it's important <coughs> as a minister that you be for real at what you're doing. All right. All right. All right. All right. For those of you that have your Bibles, uh, go to a very familiar passage of Scripture, taken out of the book of St. Luke chapter 11. <laughs> no, excuse me, Mark chapter 11. All right. And starting at verse number 12, I'm going to read a few verses and then skip down. Mark chapter 11, and starting at verse number 12. And if you don't mind, if you have if you don't mind standing with me, so I know you're with me. Mark chapter 11 and verse number 12 says, And on the mark, when they were come from Bethany, he was hungry. And seeing a fig tree of fall off, having leaves, he came, if happily he might find anything thereon. All right. When he came to it, he found nothing but leaves. All right. For the time of figs was not yet. Then verse 14, and Jesus answered and said unto it, No man eat fruit of thee hereafter forever. And his disciples heard it. Let's skip on down to verse number 20. It says, And in the morning, as they passed by, they saw a fig tree dried up from the roots. And Peter, calling to remember, said unto him, Master, behold, the fig tree which thou cursest is withered away. And Jesus answered and said unto them, Have faith in God. Amen. You may be seated. In verse number 13, if you don't mind, let me just read that again. It says, And seeing a fig tree a fall off, having leaves, he came. If happily he might find anything thereon. And when he came to it, he found nothing but leaves. For the time of feed was not yet. If you don't mind, will you turn just for a moment and look at your neighbor and ask them this question, are you, are you perpetrating? perpetrating? Amen. Let's give the Lord a hand of prayer. Wearing a Rolex. All right, all right. Yeah. 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 But 
I wanted to get a pair of white tennis shoes, and my daughter knows all about these different brands and everything, and she said, Daddy, you need to get you a pair of Air Force. I said, all right. She said, now you can go down on Salem Road to the flea market. I just said, and you can get a pair of Air Force tennis shoes. Well, I said, well, uh, how much are they going to, they going to cost? And, and she said, well, Daddy, they, uh, those will be knockoffs, but they'll be uh, 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 approximately $80. I said, $80? <laughs> or well, knockoff? And she said, well, yeah, Daddy, the real thing costs about 200 So I said, well, I guess I won't be wearing the real thing no, the knockoffs. Can I get a witness here? <laughs> Yeah. You can make two bricks or more bricks look the same, but when it comes 